the greatest fight I announced here at Showtime, and in fact, the best fight I've ever announced in my 35-year career uh, was Jose Luis Castillo and Diego Corrales. We've got two guys who personify toughness, power, and courage. Here we go. Castillo just matching Corrales punch for punch. Here's Corrales now. It's his turn. And back comes Castillo. The war of attrition as advertised rages on. Oh, what a left by Corrales. Unbelievable. Ebb and flow. The action just never lets up. By the middle of the fight, we knew that we were seeing the fight of the year. What we didn't know is we might be seeing the fight of the century. One of the things that makes that fight special for me is that as I was sitting at ringside, it's impossible not to appreciate Jose Luis Castillo or Diego Corrales as fighters. They were warriors, they were skilled, and they put everything on the line that night. Round 10, they touch gloves, and here by Castillo, and Corrales is down. What a dramatic moment here in round 10. Castillo looking to finish it here. He goes down again. When Corrales went down for the second time, the fight appeared to be over, and that would have made this fight a classic. Right. Right. Dreadful round for Corrales. Down two times here in the 10th. Corrales comes back, a straight right. Now Castillo against the ropes. Corrales coming back. Castillo's in trouble. Week steps in, and the fight is over. Corrales with a remarkable, dramatic turnaround to win this fight. I'll never forget being in that arena. People were stunned. That round and that moment kind of typifies, doesn't it, what boxing is all about. With this wonderful artistry and this excitement, there's always the unexpected.